So the evening was fantastic, beautiful. Our hostess at the most is Floating Lara, always on point, always bringing the crowd. She's full of energy, young, talented, spirited. That's what the UK market is to see, more Floating Lara. This was just another fantastic addition to Flo's already floating, beautiful, wonderful self. She's an amazing singer, right? A few people know how to express themselves between music uh, and uh, words, lyrics. She's the one. She was amazing. I would love to get her, uh, her album, actually, that she was talking about. But she held it down with the poetry, held it down with the singing, stage presence. I was very impressed. The event was fantastic. I mean, especially Lara, actually. I, she, um, she reminded me of Jill Scott. She is, I've heard a few things going around that she is a UK Jill Scott. What, what's, what's it about her that you think resembles Jill Scott quite a lot? It's her style, you know, the way her, her tone of voice, first of all, it does resemble Jill Scott for me. Well, I'm talking about her right now, and she's amazing, and I know that she's going to be doing great things. Good. Nice guys, that's what we're waiting for. Lately, I've seen changes in your vibe, baby. Could we ever make it right? Can we be together for tonight? Your energy, it made me feel so right. Sweeter than a rainbow, this love will also grow. Sweeter than an afterglow, and I'll make you so. Sweeter than a melody, and the birds in the tree. Your love completes me so easily. What do you think of the new single? The new single, fabulous, excellent. It should be up to be nominated for a Grammy and Mobile Awards. Very impressive. When she started singing from the beginning, so she smacked out with a single, she's very, very, very good. And I'm here with Lyrical Healer. You're the writer of the single. How did, how did the song come about? Well, it's really interesting. Myself and Floetic Clara, we went to um, Falaraki a couple of times. And um, I think it was on our second visit on the beach. We were sitting down and I was going through all of my songs. Night Skies came up and she started singing it and this was like I think four or five years ago. She did it four years ago. So it's grown and it's something that you've birthed. You know, it's, it's wonderful. Um, it's obviously a pleasure to work and a gift to work with Floetic Lara. I mean she's super talented and when she gets on stage audience are just like wowed by her. She's got some sort of spark that no one else has quite got yet. That don't mean I don't want you around so many emotions to explore your loving. I simply adore sweeter than a rainbow. This love will also grow. Sweeter than an afterglow, and I'll make you so sweeter than a melody and the birds in the tree. Your love completes me. I'm Maureen Atumi and I'm here with Floetic Lara at Poetry and Motion. She has just finished hosting the event, singing and doing everything else. And that's more than enough to say. How are you doing? I'm good. I'm very good. Especially because it's been a very energetic night. I've had the whole band around me. Um, and it's just great to be able to share my music, share my thoughts. Tell me a little bit about that. What is it about that song that caught you? When I first heard the song, it was actually kind of a soul R&B style. That's what connected with me and the catchiness. Midnight skies fall. I just thought catchy. And the album is named. The album is for lovers of dot dot dot. A little bit of mystery there. When when can we expect that? Possibly next year because I want to put out a couple of singles. Um, and the first one, obviously, Night Skies. The fact that she went to Jamaica, Top Gong Studio, and recorded it where Bob Marley um, done some recordings as well, it means that we've got the whole ancestral energy going on as well. I was out in Jamaica, and my father's Jamaican. Being in my father's land was a great experience. Being in 
the Tough Gong Studios was amazing, you know? Because it's a studio that I know has a lot of good energy, good spirit there. Also, obviously, the culture, the food. So we're just going to make sure that every DJ in the world gets a copy of this track, Night Skies. It's a big track. It's Floetic Lara's debut, people. So you have to go out and support. Check her out at www floeticlara.com and make sure you go and pick up your copy of Night Skies. This album that's coming out is called Four Lovers of... Dot, dot, dot. Four Lovers of Culture, Four Lovers of Sound, Four Lovers of Respect, Four Lovers of Empowerment, Four Lovers of Neo Soul, Hip Hop, Cultured, Reggae, Boy, it's just for lovers.